Welcome back everyone. That bedding got real soggy. So we're cleaning it out. I think last time we cleaned the building, I said maybe that's the last time we clean it this year, but maybe this one is the last time we clean the barn. I'm gonna get this finished up and then Dad and I have a small project. Uh, he bought a, another drive through gate the other day. We're gonna set that up. So that'll take the hammer on the skid loader, put some posts in and little bit of fencing. Dad said that calf with scours from yesterday was up and trying to suck. He's still a little lethargic, but progress every day, so that's good to hear. I don't know how well the two-wheel drive tractor is going to fare in this muddy stuff. It's going to be hard getting in position and getting out of there. bit of distance between the spreader and the front door might make a little mess but we'll get it in there I know it's pretty dry over here. I don't know if I should turn left right away. I don't know, this tractor's on standby if we need it.
Golly, don't do it. Oh, son of a... Oh, shoot. Hey, mind if you go back in? Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Oh, he... just don't go back in that barn. All right. Spreading the bedding, I look up and there's a cow eating it. She's just coming up for a drink. I can get this stuff shut now. In a little bit, Dad's gonna be grinding some hay, so we gotta move some alfalfa back there to prepare for that. We can sit in a cab for a little bit and drive around. While they're finishing up, I'm gonna start bringing some materials over to this gate where we're gonna put a drive-through gate into one of our pastures. These drive-through gates, it just makes life easier. And it may sound crazy, but I think these drive-through gates are gonna make our cattle healthier. Now, Cole, how do, how do you get to that conclusion? When it's 90 degrees out, and I'm thinking, man, I should go check on them cattle, and I think, oh, I don't want to. But I don't have to get out of the AC gator and open a gate. And then remember to shut that gate. I can just drive right in, check them over. I think it's also going to keep our pastures less weedy. I know I could just cruise on in, spray some weeds, get out of there. Don't even have to step off the four-wheeler. Now, I'm not a lazy guy, and if you think I am, then you haven't watched enough of these videos because they are literally me working. Those little things just make life a whole lot better. I mean, right now, I got some hip pain, and it sounds nice not having to get off of something and open a gate and shut a gate. What is this man doing? Holy smokes, he's got four bales up there. <laughs> Holy smokes. That's the craziest thing I've ever seen. Oh. What the? I was not prepared for that. Holy smokes, that is light on the back end. IV that Doc gave it yesterday. Calf's up walking. I want to look at the teeth of this cow, see if she's been sucked.
now I'm guessing when I picked those four bales up, it was froze together. Yeah, we might have hung that a little high, but we won't have to worry about it in the snow. So when I came in here to drop the pounder off, I drove in, and then this fell over because of the wind, and then I didn't see it, and I backed over it. So now we got crushed flattened broom this chair two. one more pasture we plan on putting a drive through gate on later this year then we can zip around all our pastures real quick it's gonna start warming up and man it's just a couple weeks and planting season is gonna start isn't that crazy I hope if you're new here you enjoyed hit that subscribe button and you hang out with us here at Sunny Farms thanks for watching everybody love to see you next time have a good one My dad makes me happy. <laughs> I smile at the farm. I'm happy being with my dad. You weren't there when this picture was taken. I'm happy because my dad's not here. <laughs> <laughs>